Hi, welcome to Mits It Up. This is my first video for Mits It Up video channel and I hope you enjoy it. Thank you. If you like the channel, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Bye-bye. Today I'll be talking about my updated um, night care routine. Uh, I am 38 week pregnant and uh, yes, I am waiting for my uh, little panda to come out. So I have made a few changes to my nighttime routine and uh, I am in Kerala. It is very humid over here. So, uh, oh, my little kid is kicking. Yeah. So uh, I wanted to update you guys about my nighttime routine. So yes, number one, first thing I do is cleansing. Cleansing your skin is very, very, very important. You have makeup or not, you need to cleanse your skin every single day. So now, if I don't have makeup, I don't go for these elaborate cleansing methods which I usually have, which I have blocked about it once as well. But usually right now I don't wear a lot of makeup. So I just prefer this Meiku 100% maple water uh, foaming cleanser. So it cleans my skin pretty well. It's very soothing. See, when you're pregnant, your skin is kind of prone to a lot of redness, a lot of um, uh, all that extra blood over there. So, you know, you kind of get a lot of redness on your face, at least for me. So I should say that I, I have concentrated my products, my nighttime products, to calm the redness more and to, you know give a calming and soothing effect to my skin a little hydration stuff like that so yes this makeup does not dry me out it is perfectly it cleans out all my um, impurities on my face and it gives a really good you know a, a good supple feeling Number two, so if I have to uh, go for a deeper cleansing and uh, uh, scrubbing to get rid of white heads on my nose and under my lips area, uh, I go for this Nivea Total Face Cleanup. It does the work perfectly fine. In fact, it is a multitasking product. It acts as a face wash, a scrub, uh, a face pack, a spot treatment, all this in one. So yes, this is kind of a multitasking tool for me. Uh, I must say that this does give me a little tingling um, effect. I think it is due to the redness and the whole um, sensitive skin I have in this pregnancy. But other than that, I don't think um, uh, you know anybody else would have any issue with it. If you do, please put it on the comments. But so yeah, this one is my scrub, pack, um, whatever, you know once in a while treatment number three the third step is um, the Kiehl's midnight uh, recovery concentrate there you can see that you can see that yeah yes now uh, I know this is claimed as a miracle product by many uh, I personally haven't felt any miracle happening to my skin uh, with the keel side, uh, but um, I should say in this pregnancy, uh, it has helped me to calm down redness through my nose and uh, my cheek area. It has helped me to calm down the redness in the pregnancy. Uh, so it has this very Ayurvedic uh, herbal kind of smell. And it is an oil. Yes, it is an oil. You just need about four or five drops of it uh, in the night. And uh, they say it does wonders to your skin. It has not done wonders to my skin. It has not broke me out. And uh, it has calmed my skin. That's pretty much what it is. Now, number four. 
some hydration that is aqua rush uh, cream by brtc that is a korean company i will put down the review of this and makeup uh, face cleanser down in the down there <laughs> you can you can you can just read that so yes aqua rush cream by brtc very very watery very um it comes in a cute little um tub like this glass tub see that it is very um very much a watery watery cream water based and it gives that essential uh you know moisture lock for my skin so i usually use this as my night cream um, after my keels so uh, if anybody has missed out on my blog post on what is the way that you have you should be using your skincare please i would put that link as well below please please read it number 4 or is it number 5 Okay, number five. Uh, the final step I usually go for is just this Kama Ayurveda Pure Rose Water Mist. You can use rose water in any form, uh, but yeah, I would say use it as a mist rather than just dabbing it with a cotton. When you have all these products on your face, you don't really want to wipe them all off. So having a small little, you know, pump like this. Can you see that? Yeah. pump like this can really help uh, just to give that actual moisture feeling on your face do not wipe it off just let it air dry just let it air dry uh, there are some other uses in which i use a face mist i shall be blogging about it very soon um, and uh, you might want to really invest in a face mist so yeah that's the five essential products uh, that i use as a night uh, care routine right now in my pregnancy so if you are using any of this uh, please leave me a comment how you like it and how you are using it uh, and i'd look forward to your comments if you like the video please give it a thumbs up this is my first attempt i may be making mistakes i have no clue this it, it actually feels odd to actually you know just talk to the camera but yeah i think i'll get over it um so give it a like and please subscribe to my channel yeah thank you i'll see you soon with another video on oh, my baby <laughs> thank you bye bye